Tennessee Valley Authority announced today it has applied for a construction permit to build a small modular reactor at the Clinch River site near Oak Ridge. This comes as the power generator and its partners develop new modern nuclear reactors in East Tennessee. And 10 News reporter Maria Guzman joins us with the very latest on what developed today. Maria. Robin, John, for about five years, the TVA has been trying to bring this first of its kind development to East Tennessee. And today, the TVA and four other international companies have finally come to an agreement to get the ball rolling. Claps of celebration came from our nation's capital as four international power energy companies united to help bring the next generation of modern nuclear reactors to East Tennessee. Their union is marked by an agreement called the Technical Collaboration Agreement, or TCA for short. This team has come together through a lot of hard work to make this possible today. So the agreement is signed and we're very excited for the work ahead. This new partnership brings together two American companies, one Polish and one Canadian, to develop a standard design for the reactor and help fund a portion of the cost. The cost expected to be $400 million. It takes, you know, a lot of dollars to make real change happen. And the federal government can't provide all of those dollars. Our one dollar needs to turn into trillions of dollars on the private side. And this group of individuals is doing just that. This is a push to create net zero carbon energy projects to make power more environmentally friendly. But this is not good news for everyone. Stephen Smith with the Southern Alliance for Clean Energy calls this ambition plan by the TVA a pipe dream. He says with very little details on execution, it's unrealistic and expensive. Enthusiasm and people jumping up and down and saying how great something is. We don't have a design. We don't have a cost. We don't have a schedule. He says the TVA has a history on leading projects like this one go over budget and over their timeline. He says this one could be the same. You're bound to repeat it. <laughs> and the history with TVA and nuclear power is, is really, from a cost perspective, is not a good one. Now, the TVA has a goal of decarbonization by 2025. This first step in developing the Clinch Riverside is a step towards that. Robin, John. Maria, thank you.